Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. I am just gonna jump right into today's video because it's gonna be something different I've never really done on my channel before. If you guys don't know, I say this kind of a lot, uh, I'm a Libra and I know a lot of people are probably like, girl, like signs, really? Yes, my organization skills are, I like to think are super, super good. I'm a very, very organized person. And especially when it comes to my makeup, oh, I have so much of it, it has to be organized. If it's not organized, girl, I don't know what I would do. Right now, it looks, my filming room looks a mess because I just filmed the TikTok and I was working on doing my highlighter video for you guys, so I have to put away all my highlighters and things like that. If you guys have not seen like my whole like makeup collection video, I go through all of my makeup, you know, and show you guys how it's all organized and how it's stored. I'm very happy with how my collection was in that video, but there is one thing that I'm always constantly thinking about that I just feel like is not completely organized to how I want it to be, and that's my lip products. Like I I swear I cannot get my lip products to be as organized as I want to. Um, not just that, I feel like my lipsticks are okay. Like if you guys see that, I'll put a picture on the screen of how my lipsticks look. I love that, I think it's great, but when it comes to lip glosses, Girl, that's another story. I, like my lip glosses are like back here in these things right here, but I don't use them as much because I don't see them. If I don't see it, I don't use it, you know? So I honestly just use these that are right here on my everyday makeup table. This is literally all the lip products that I use. I got the goodies, okay? I got the goodies. So your girl went to TJ Maxx. Look at Callie, Callie's getting up from her nap. Your girl went to TJ Maxx and Michaels and picked up some organizers. I was on the hunt to find another organizer like the ones back there. And I finally found the same one that I had back there at TJ Maxx, so I picked that up. I don't know what's going in it. I was watching my friend El Negs. He's another YouTuber here on YouTube. Go subscribe to his channel. I seriously love his content and we are becoming really, really great friends. He has some really great content and he kind of sparked this video today because I was watching his like vanity tour and he just pulled out this little big old organizer with a whole bunch of lip glosses in it, right? And I was like, oh my God. I texted him, I said, I need to know, where did you get this? Where did you get this? He said he went to Michael's and he had this genius idea to take like this little jewelry storage. This is like for like glitter, like glitter little vials or whatever. And he put all of his glosses in it and it looked so pretty. I was like, I need that. That's what I've been needing for my glosses. So your girl went to Michael's. I picked up two of them. I wanna organize this. I wanna organize some other drawers that I'm not too happy about in my collection. And I thought that we would do it all together, which would be really fun. So we are like back here where everything is. Now, what I want to do is, I wanna grab these. What I'm gonna do is take these down, this up. All right, I need to see what is going to actually fit in these. Let's try a glam light gloss. Hey, the glam light gloss fits perfect. All right, so my glam light gloss fits perfectly in here. So I'm gonna just take out all of the glam light glosses. I don't, I don't really think that this one will fit because of the component that it's in. Oops. If I don't see the glosses that are in this, these little containers, then I won't use them. No, Lunar Beauty, you are not fitting. What's really going on? So what's left for Glam Light are the triangle type of lipsticks. So I can't really do much with those. So those are gonna have to stay in the container. So I have my NYX Butter Glosses. So we're gonna put them down here. They fit great down here. That's cute. They're, they're not the best fit, but like they fit, they look cute. And then we have this one from NYX, which doesn't fit. All right, so I guess we'll put that in, back in here. This looks so good, El Negs, you're, so, you're such a genius. Oh my gosh, okay. And then Juvia's Place glosses won't fit. Okay, so next I have all of my like ColourPop 
what is this? The Ultra Glossy Lips and the Ultra Matte Lips. So I'm gonna go ahead and fit that in here. I'm gonna put the, I'm actually gonna move the Kylie. Okay, okay, hold on. No, I'm actually gonna keep these like that. I'm gonna go ahead and take all of the ColourPop lip glosses because I'm gonna put them in this because this is, I bought two of these containers, so I wanna put the ones that I know I'm gonna use the most in here. So glosses is what I reach for over liquid lipsticks. So the ColourPop liquid lipsticks are gonna go in the other container like this because it seems like I only have a little bit more room for taller glosses or lipsticks on this side because it kind of like has a little dip. I love this. Okay, so that's what we're gonna do. So this is what I left in here. Um, I think I'm gonna just move these butter glosses back here. I don't think that I have any other lipsticks or lip glosses that will fit in this. Everything else won't fit, so they'll stay in these like little containers or whatnot. I wonder if the roller glosses from ColourPop, nope, the roller glosses don't fit. I'm gonna go ahead and find a place to put this. I bought two. I mean, I mean, I think I will keep both just in case, in case I can't find this anymore. I am gonna keep the other one even though I don't have enough tall glosses to fill it, but I feel like I will eventually collect some, some more over time. But this looks good. I love how this looks. So let's go ahead and move on to the next organizer. I went and pulled all of my lip balms, which are right here. And then also my lip masks and my lip scrubs. Well, some of my lip scrubs. I have a lot in my bathroom, like a lot from Tatiana Nisa Cosmetics. Um, and these are just like other ones that I'm not currently using at the moment. Uh, so I just went and pulled those. I have the new organizer that I went and purchased today. So what I was thinking was I wanna put all of my lip balms in here. I don't know how I'm gonna organize them. So I'll just start putting some in here. I think I kind of figured it out. So in here, I'm putting all of like my squeeze tube lip balms in this little section right here. And then in this section, I'm putting all of my lip balms that are like tubed. So like these are all of my Juvia's Place ones. Um, I have my ColourPop ones. I also have my hard candy lip balms that I like. Mm, smells so good. And then I'm gonna take the lip balms that are kind of like in like pots. They'll probably have to lay down. Yeah, like that. And then I'm gonna put my lip oils down in one of these. So I have my Morphe lip oil. Um, this is my Becca lip mask and this is my Becca lip scrub. So I don't really know where these are gonna go yet. Um, I think down here is where I'm gonna put like the lip mask because it's a lot like deeper. So they'll sit nicely in here. And then we have lip scrubs will go in this section right here. It looks really good. I still have this like empty spot here. I am gonna take, so I have another organizer over there, which I keep my other lip mask in. Um, is this lip mask or is this lip scrub? This is a lip scrub. Oops, so I'll put that in here. And then all my other lip masks will go in here. It looks how I want it to look. And then we're gonna put this up here next to it and then this one right here. Ooh, they fit perfect. Oh, wait, do they? Oh, hold on. Oh, they fit so perfect. They look pretty empty now that I've like put all my other lips down there, but I really like how this looks, except now I just need to reorganize these little containers here. Oh, this looks so good and it's like the perfect fit. It's like I was missing the middle organizer and I'm so happy that I saw it at the TJ Maxx that I went to. This little organizer right here, um, I have all my ColourPop So Juicy glosses, so I think that's fine. Okay, that looks good. I think that looks good. I still don't have anything to go in the middle one. 
Um, this one over here is empty. Um, but this is Morphe, Juvia's Place. I need to fix this because this like looks a mess. I forgot that I had these two Juvia's Place glosses. So these two could fit in that little organizer or could they? They probably couldn't. Hold on. That's pretty much done. I will fill it up eventually, but right now it is pretty empty. So that's just gonna have to stay like that. But so far I do like how this looks. It just looks really good together. And I finally have a place for my lip scrubs, my lip mask and my lip balm. So I'm happy about that. That's something that I really needed to organize better. And now it's organized, which makes me super happy. All right, so I really wanted to find another spot for all my Jaclyn Cosmetic products. So what I decided to do was use this drawer for all of my Jaclyn Cosmetics. Whenever I really, really like a brand, I kind of dedicate a drawer specifically to them and their products. Um, I've done it with ColourPop, I've done it with Juvia's Place, and I've done it with Beauty Bay. And then Jaclyn Cosmetics is the fourth brand. So this right here is my filming table. I already kind of started to like organize it a bit, but I really want this table to be clean. It's never clean. There's always a bunch of products everywhere. Um, I do keep all of my Jaclyn blending brushes up here because these are my favorite, but I think I am gonna add my favorite Morphe brushes on the end. table has literally never looked this clean like it looks really really good and I'm really happy with it I feel like oh what the heck okay why is that there I feel like I've never seen it this clean I'm like let me clean this off I love it I want to keep it this way I always feel like something is like missing on this side um, but I love how my brushes are laid out looks really really good and yeah I'm super super happy with it I feel like if I put this up here, it might kind of decl like it might kind of like clutter it up. I don't know, maybe like right here, maybe right there. How do we think that looks? I think that might look good. I feel like I could put like my everyday like. I mean, well, this table is my everyday makeup table. Like I don't know if you guys remember. I do want to do like an updated like what to my everyday makeup drawer type thing, but. I feel like the products that like like complexion that I'm like obsessed with constantly want to grab I might like just put it put it in here um I don't know but I do have my shop my stash of course but yeah so I don't know so really quickly I wanted to show you guys what I did so I took all of my setting sprays first of all I got these cute little bins from five below which 
super cute. I love them. They're pink. I feel like it looks really good like as an accent in my filming room. So I got these and put all of my setting sprays in here. They literally all fit perfectly in here. I don't know if you guys remember, but my setting sprays were in this drawer. Right here, I just keep like backup, like the backups of my setting sprays down there. So it's kind of like, I don't know. I just like it better up here, if that makes sense. So, all right, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed organizing some of my makeup with me. I had so much fun doing this on camera. I, it felt really, really different, but I had fun and I hope to do this again in the future. Maybe like a clean my makeup with me or something like that. Let me know if you guys like these kind of videos. I just want to bring some new, fresh content to my channel. I think I might start to incorporate vlogging in my channel. You, we, I haven't vlogged in a while. I used to vlog a lot. My channel used to be a vlog channel, but I have not vlogged in a while, but I think that's something I am gonna start doing. You guys, let me know if there's any kind of videos you wanna see, drop them down below. I will be so happy to film them for you guys. Seriously, I love taking your requests because I want to film what you guys wanna see. But okay guys, I'm gonna end this video right here. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button before you leave and give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.